Hello everybody. We are in my home back in Massachusetts right now. Um, I'm here for a couple of days to do some random things before like I graduate and stuff. I'm gonna get a spray tan tomorrow, period. I was just kind of feeling it. I always feel like cuter with the tan. My mom had a package at this place. So I was like, you know what? I might just do it and look sun kissed on my graduation when I walk, which is Monday and today is Tuesday. So, so it was a week from yesterday. Today I need to shoot this Jaded London little set. So honored that they sent me stuff. So I need to do that and get a post up, but we are starting a day early. Linda's coming to pick me up at like 9.45, so in like 15 minutes. We're gonna do our classic duo. Just get coffee before thrifting, it's like nothing crazy. I think we're gonna do Starbucks just cause it's easy. Gonna grab some Starbs and then hit hit the thrift. And so, sorry I'm like crouching, so like my back, my back's starting to hurt. Linda's been in my videos with Ellie. So if you guys watch that channel, Ellen and Chloe, then you'll recognize her completely. I also talk about her all the time, but she's never been in a video in this channel, I don't think. So that'll be really exciting. So we'll vlog. I'll try to like remember to vlog as much as I can like in the thrift while also like not annoying people. Kind of like a thrift with me, but then also haul after. Yeah, I'm very excited. This is my favorite thrift store, like low key of all time. So it's just the savers, but I just feel like the prices, the hunt is so much fun. I always find like a ton of stuff especially like after I haven't been for a while, I usually like fill up a cart, which is sickening. I also have a ton to bring and a ton to donate. My mom's giving me stuff. I have some coupons, um, but I brought some stuff back from New York that I need to donate slash sell because there's also a Play-Doh's closet here and I sell my stuff there and then give you like cash trade up, which is really cool. So I might go there as well. Um, but yeah, back in Massachusetts, so exciting. So happy to be home. I slept so good in my bed last night. I got here yesterday and yeah, Lynn's coming soon. And we're just gonna do our thing. I think I'm gonna get a guava drink cause you guys know it's good. Okay, wow. This shirt, I'm not even kidding guys. Jaded London, I'm not even wearing a bra pushes the titties up nicely. I forget what the set is called, but I can put the name right here. It's so cute and the pants are like long and flared. I'll give you a better view of the outfit when Lynn and I are taking outfit pictures. I'll try to um, record that as well. But this is just my jacket that I've thrifted. Um, these hoops got are from like Claire's or something. They're literally rusting. I need to get new gold hoops so bad. This bandana I just got, I think on Amazon, these clips. I think I also got on Amazon or like a beauty supply store. Um, rings, crack couture, this is the Sage Vintage. And yeah, thrift day baby. I really want, if we have time, to go to High Energy Vintage in Somerville, but it's kind of a drive. Thrift with me vibes. Let's get on into it. I will vlog when I'm with Lenny and we're conquering savers. <laughs> I mean, Trenta. These are Trentas. No, I'm not bullshitting you. <laughs> Linda, this is a Trenta. <laughs> this is way bigger. They said, get somebody get these girls some Trentas. <laughs> yes. Yes. Hey guys, it's Linda. Hey. Oh my God, what? Thank you. What'd you get? What was your Starbucks order? It's Wait, so oh, big. Genuinely, this is huge. Wait, what do you think of the lemonade? I love it. It's really good. Do you like that one better? Well, um, no, I think this is Wait, good. Wait, why can't I fucking think of? Oh, sweet cream cold brew. Oh, oh, vent vanilla. She got a venti sweet cream cold brew. Vanilla sweet cream cold brew. Vanilla sweet cream cold brew. Well, of a black tea, half sweetened with lemonade. Mmm, mmm, very good. Don't you ever forget about the give back section. Don't you ever forget it. So good. Literally just found this girls. If you know me, Miami party. Per. But don't you ever forget it. The give back section right by the clay changing rooms. Come on now. Hi you guys. So Linda and I, we are now looking through my saved photos on Instagram as well as just, you know. So we're just trying to find some ins for the fit. Because I don't want it to be boring 
and I'll show you guys our main inspo photos. I'll put them on the screen right now. Yes. Okay, vlog update. High Energy Vintage was closed in Somerville. So, we're going to our second fave thrift we're in Boston now or Cambridge and it's the Goodwill on Commonwealth Ave and she's not getting out of the car oh because she's parked okay and then we're gonna go get vegan food for lunch oh like the meters we're gonna figure out parking one second bye yeah bye <laughs> Good start though. Honesty, yeah, the idea is there. Honesty during a photo shoot is so uh, important. So important. Be honest. Be honest. Mm. Y'all, I'm telling you, this place never disappoints. So gas. We got the BU burger and the chicken sandwich and the loaded yeah. fries. It's all vegan. I'm so full. 10 out of 10. Hello, everybody. Welcome to my room at home. Um, it's a little chaotic. My mom kind of turned it into her art studio, so... Ignore that, ignore the chaos, but I'm going to be hauling what I got at the thrift stores that I went to. I went to another back in Long Island, it's called Bargain Box Thrift, and it's probably like the only <laughs> thrift store like in the close proximity where we go. So um, I always try to hit it and can see what they've got. So I might start with that because I'm super excited about one thing in particular that I got there. I might scooch a little bit, so I can put my like try on portion little video clips here. I'm gonna do that. Basically, yeah, you all are like, girl, what is this? Um, and I'm gonna be, I forgot I put my jewelry on this dress, whoops. I'm gonna be doing like a try on portion, of course. So you all will see what this looks like on, but it is this hilarious like princess dress. It has these poofy ass, sleeves which I'm obsessed with and then this stretchy kind of torso part and then it looks like it's kind of gonna go all the way down but it doesn't it kind of goes past my knees it's hilarious obviously I'll show the try on here um, so you guys can see what it looks like on I think it'll be so funny to style and like just like fun to wear to wherever I end up wearing it to. <laughs> um, but I love it and I love like buying dresses that I have like no occasion to wear them to because like you will eventually find something and you're like, then it just it makes it more fun and you've been like wanting to style it for forever. So this brand, I like can't really read the handwriting. Looks like Elizabeth, but I can't tell if that's a G or a C. I don't know. More things at that thrift shop, the Bargain Box Thrift in Long Island. I got a couple of ties because they were having a sale on ties. So I got this. It's just pink, you know, pink stripe, and I love pink, and I think I was due for a pink tie in my tie collection. Then I got this one. It's just like kind of this purpley blue color, and it's striped with yellow, white, and black. Yeah, it's like that. Very cute. And then I think I got one more tie. Oh yeah, I really like this one. These were all eight bucks, but they were um, half off. But it's this really pretty, like shiny plaid and I love like the colors in it the purple and the green and the yellow and all that jazz it's really cute so that'll be really fun to style then I got this little button up and I have like a vision for this because I want to do something like fun with it I don't know but I think it's super cute I dug it when I was there it's just it has a white collar and it orange kind of comes like mid arm which is cute 
and I don't know, it'll be fun to layer with. Emma X Winder on um, Instagram, I hope I'm pronouncing her last name right. Um, she's like another big fashion influence for me. She always like does kind of outfits that are that kind of vibe. So here are like her pictures that I'm like, I'm obsessed with and I wanna do something similar to that. And then of course, Maria Burnett with her style always inspiring me. Inspo Queens, I'm obsessed with them. I think y'all should follow them. They just give me a lot of um, style inspo. That taught me me think of them and a potential look I could do. Oh, I don't know if y'all heard that, but I think that was my dog. I need to let him in. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So finishing up the stuff I got at Bargain Box. Um, I think it's just this necklace left. It has cute little black hearts on it and gold hearts as well. And it's just this like little choker thing. And I don't know why it spoke to me, but I feel like it could be really cute with like a fun black dress or you know, a fit that gold's really popping in. I just liked it, so I got it. <laughs> I went to Salvation Army and I got two things there. One being this tie that I'm obsessed with. Are you kidding? That's so cool. I don't know, I just dig it and I think it could be a really fun statement in an outfit. Big shop for ties, I guess. I, I lucked out with the tie situation, so that's nice. And then I got these black trousers, which you know, I don't know how they'll fit because none of these places, by the way, had um, their dressing rooms open. So, kinda had to wing it, but I feel like these might fit maybe a little low waisted, I'm hoping. But they're just black trousers. You got really linty in my dryer, so wing. But we'll see in the try on how these fit and if I dig them but I like them. I really want like low waist black trousers that are just like a good go-to, you know? So hoping those will become my go-to, but who knows? And then now we'll do the Savers haul. So um, we went early in the morning and we get there and there are like so many cars and we're like, what's going on? It opened 20 minutes ago. Why are there so many cars? And we didn't realize it was seniors day. So there were, so many old people shopping with us and it was so cute, but I felt bad cause like that's clearly their day to like not be invaded by, you know, teens and things. So I was like trying to stay out of their way and stuff, but it was a little chaotic, but you know, still think I got some good things, nothing crazy. I remember mentioning like, I usually fill up a cart. I did not fill up a cart this time, which was totally fine. But I think I still got some fun things that I'm excited and happy about, so. I'll start off first off with this cute bra. I love, y'all know I love like weird kind of like grainy bra style stuff. And so when I saw this, I was like, yeah, it's just so cute, you know? And I think it'll fit real nice. It'll be cute to wear under blazers, under, you know, jackets, things and stuff like that. Really cute. So I like that. I like this bra. Oh my God. I'm so sorry, y'all. I got this little gingham boob top at the bargain box, I did. And I think fun layering with this. It's like a little Brainy Melville-esque, um, which is, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just not necessarily like my style. But I think if I like layer this and do really fun things, it could be fun. So got that. And if I don't like it, I'll give it to my sister. So, um, but going back to Savers, what I got at Savers, I got this bathing suit top. It's so cute with the little rhinestone. I could literally just wear it as a top anyways. But it's a halter and it's coral and I dig it a lot. She's very cute. Another bathing suit top, cause I was like there for suits, right? Like I wanted to get stuff for Miami and just like fun beachy stuff or like cover up stuff. So then I got this cute ass little bathing suit tube top. So cute and I think the color is so fun. It's like a burnt orange, dark red kind of vibe. And I think this will be really cute with these really high-waisted um, like 90s vintage bottoms that I have. The blue ones, I showed them in my last video, second last video, I don't know. But I showed them and they're very cute and I don't have a matching bikini top with it. So I think this could be really fun with like a fun hat and necklaces and stuff. I don't know, but I got this and it's very cute. There's like padding in it and such. This um bathing suit skirt which is so cute and i want to wear it like low rise with my bikini bottoms coming out so cute 
and yeah there's built-in like bottoms in it but i think i might cut those out and just wear this as like a cover-up but it is swim material which is cool i love it then i got these like golfer shorts i don't even know what brand they are american trouser and i think they're really funny and you know you know she does her hair and i have no idea if they're gonna fit my waist they seem tiny so they might be squeezing me but I think they'll be really cute with, honestly, Linda and I came up with this kind of fit on the whim when we were shopping. These with this bra top and this blazer. I think would be so fun and like groovy big glasses. This just gave us instant Harry Styles vibes and all over it. It's got that cream, it's got that navy, just like a classic check. And I think it would be really cute with these shorts and that bra top and like high socks and like little loafers or something. You can maybe even do a tie with it. Just something like really schoolboy vibes. I think that could be so cool. So I'm excited to style this. You know, black bikini bottoms because I've been needing some. And I'm hoping that they just sit kind of higher rise on me. I can like pull them up onto my hips. So we'll see. I've washed all this stuff. So um, I probably like won't try these on for you because they're just basic black bikini bottoms. Um, oh, I dropped some accessories. I got this cute ass little teddy bear pin that I would love to put on my ties when I wear ties or little jackets, even that blazer, you know. Just a fun little pin. Get into the pin moment. Get into the pin moment. And I love bears. Y'all know that. I love teddy bears. I like it. So I got it. Got the scarf. Very groovy. Orange. Brown. Do a little tie. Do a little. Do, you know, one of these. Oh, it looks cute with my outfit right now, actually. But very cute. I'm excited about this. And I love the color scheme. I got these pearls, just like a nice off-white, pretty champagne pearl color. Super pretty, nice like choker fit. I'm kind of over, I have the Vivian Westwood just like single pearl necklace with like the orb in the center that like everybody got or got knockoffs of. And now I'm like, damn, okay. I feel like I'm gonna be clowned if I wear that, but I'm still obviously gonna wear it because I paid a lot of money for it but i think this layered with it could either just like switch up the look or this could like replace it in some outfits and i don't know be a variation of the pearl look so i was into it very cute definitely not real so but i don't care this necklace yeah. and i love it i just think it'll be so cool i think layered with a bunch of other necklaces i love spirals i'm excited about this i think this honestly with like the beaded necklaces even my like Freak, evil eye, just like a whole moment. You know what I'm saying? You'll see it styled on the gram eventually. This is coming to Miami with me. All of this stuff is pretty much, maybe not the purple dress. Actually, could that be a vibe? Could it be a vibe? Last but certainly not least, bitch. Okay, this is so weird. I manifested this like crazy. I remember driving home with my mom from Long Island to here. And I was like, girl, like, do you know where at home I could get like a beach hat that's like not your typical, you know, influencer, like floppy beach hat. I don't know that. More of like a straw kind of cowgirl hat shape, but a beach hat with like fun strength. And she was like, hmm, yeah, maybe you could try like Dick's Sporting Goods or like, bought, like, you know, Target. And I was like, Hmm, I don't know. And I tried looking in Long Island. Obviously, that would be the better bet because it's like beach town vibes. But, you know, everything was like $50 to $120. And I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't got that money right now. Walking to Savers, bitch. What the fuck? What the fuck? It's perfect. It's got that country detail, you know, giving bolo vibes. I just love it. The shape is perfect. Doesn't really look cute now with my, with my look, but pff, look at the shape. Mmm, it's not just the best. And don't worry, y'all. I sprayed it with rubbing alcohol and like wiped it and all that. That's what my mom and I do for accessories. Get a rubbing alcohol spray. Kill the germs, baby. But I love it. I'm so excited to wear this with a fun bikini in Miami and just vibe. Even on the plane in Miami. Don't start. I'm so excited! Hat of the freaking summer. I saw this hat. This hat's pretty cute. 
She's like similar vibes, but she's kind of bent. Um, I got her at thrift store too. Why is she so bent? She's supposed to be bent like that? No. The brand Quicksilva. I love a good beach hat. I love a good hat. Y'all know this about me. Well, is that everything? I think it is. I love you guys very much. Thank you so much for watching. This was super fun, super fabulous. Um, I know it's not like the biggest thrift haul, but you know, that happens and I'm excited about the stuff that I got. I'm excited for summer. I'm excited to style all this stuff. Me all the time. I'm super excited to style it. Me, I say that 24 seven. Sorry if, gets, sorry if it gets annoying. Also, that's my radiator. Keep banging in this video. Yeah. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my time at home. Went super quick. I'm getting a spray tan later today. The next video is going to be my graduation vlog and packing for Miami, all of that in, into one, all mushed together. And I'm gonna be editing it on the plane to Miami on Sunday, grinding because it's gonna be nonstop. So we're gonna put in the work for the next video. So I hope you guys like it, but I hope you like this one too. And you know, hope and encourage you to hit your local thrift, see what they got going on. Yeah. I love you guys. My hair is like two different lengths today. I think it's the way I put in this headband. I just can't deal with my hair today. So I don't know what I'm saying. I love you all very, very much. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to. And I will see you in my next video very soon. Peace.